way I think of an ecosystem is where all life comes together and has to interact. Whether it's the sea life and how we affect the sea, all of that is the ecosystem, it's the whole. I think a healthy ecosystem to me would be one that I could walk down to the beach and you know go salmon fishing or find crab and not be worried about how many I had to eat every week because of the toxins that were in them or not be worried about where I had to get them from. Well, I think you know, everybody plays an important part in cleanliness to any water system or any waterway. Uh, this particular body of water in Seattle, you, we all really didn't realize, I guess, that there were some issues with Puget Sound. I sometimes hear that people aren't aware of how poor the health of Puget Sound is because it looks so beautiful and we still are recreating, we're still able to fish, but it's all a matter of balance. The Puget Sound still looks the same as it always has from the surface, but what we know is that it's not the same and that whether it's the fish or the crabs or the harbor seals, all of these living things in Puget Sound are increasingly stressed primarily by the pressure of what we human beings are doing to the sound and to the oceans. Even in the 1880s, salmon were imperiled from some of the industries that were going on around Puget Sound. So this is not something that happened in 1980 or 90. It's the cumulative impact of the growth and the prosperity of Puget Sound. But the issues that we're dealing with in 2011 are vastly different. The big pressures now are no longer coming out of one pipe. It's really the decisions we're making on how we live on the land. And so to think about the impact of our waste, our activities, because everything it can eventually wash down into the sea. So the question is, in our everyday life, how do we perceive things that are acceptable or unacceptable? When I was growing up, it was very common to see people open the windows of their car and throw their burger wrappers or cigarette packages right out the window. Think nothing of it. And clearly that's changed. We know that if people understood better what's going on with the environment, what's going on with Puget Sound, what's going on with the oceans, and that they could make a difference, they would adapt, they would change.